Hello everybody, this is Burnage, and this is my Chrono Trigger walkthrough, and in this video we are going to go get the Chrono Clone. So, your destination is... Lean Square, 1080. To get the Chrono Clone, we got to play a game. To play the game, you need coins. There's plenty of games all around the square. I'll give you coins. The fastest and easiest way to do it, though, is via the race. Um, we have to wait till the racers finish. Basically, you bet on a race, a racer. You don't bet anything, honestly. You're just like, I guess that guy will win. If he wins, you get 20 coins. You need 40 coins. So, just win it twice, and you win. So, GI Jogger one, we're gonna go with Green Ambler. So guess a winner, Green Ambler. So you can, like, totally rig this race by running in front of people to screw them over. Yeah, there we go. Green Ambler, go! So you, like, just stop in front of them over and over, and they will slow down, and, like, yeah. So you just get your guy out front, and then once you got him out front, you, like, pretty much win. It's pretty badass. So, that's one win in the bag, 20 coins, I need another win. Guess where? Sure, this time I'm gonna go with the GI Jogger. No. Fuck you, Steel Runner. Fuck you. Stop! Stop! In the name of the law! What's going on back there? Fucker! Yeah, walk, GI Jogger. Just, just walk. Faggot. Can't believe I bet on that guy. Douche. GI Jogger can suck it. We're going with Cadillac. GI Jogger's a vagina. We going nowhere! Nowhere! That's right! Go, Cat, go! This Green Ambler wants a win. He's trying hard. He's a try hard. He's going. Can't catch Cat. Alright, so that's my second win. Sweet titties. So, now that they got here... Great, I put 27 points in your car. Now I can go in here. I don't know if it's 40, but it's definitely more than 20. Because if you win the rain race once, you still don't have enough coins. He doesn't tell you how many coins you need. Because he's a douche like that. Take the challenge. Alright, so I need... What the fuck? This is gonna be so weird. Alright, let's do this game. I think this on a keyboard is so ridiculous. It's like, what buttons did I make? What buttons? So don't tell me. Press R Q J L for these combinations. Jesus, this is hard. This is so easy on a console. right arm is the hardest. It's so confusing. Alright, sweet. I got it. I don't know what happens with you lose. I don't know if you just get to try again or if you have to farm more coins. Alright, so we got her done. Uh, now we go to Corona's house and get that clone. Collect the clone.
Alright, so we're gonna pick the clone up. It's totally lying to Colonel his mom. It's Colonel alright? Yeah, he's fine. He's not dead. Because we're reviving him. It would be like it never happened. So after you get the clone, you go back this way, and we're gonna enter the portal to the end time. Take this opportunity to switch my party, cause Frog can or Molly can suck it, but I want Frog. Alright. Board the Epoch, yes. And disembark. Full speed ahead rather. Even though it doesn't mean like the same fucking thing. It's like would you like to leave? Or would you like to leave? Uh This is conveniently right over the Keeper's Dome, where we need to go. Enter the Keeper's Dome, go to the door in the back. And up here, there is a magic tab right here. Talk to the new Balthazar. So he's going to execute his last command. Pretty much just going to Death Peak to help us do Death Peak. Alright, so he requests that we press the switch on something to turn it off, and that's what we're gonna do. So, in case it shuts off, I'm just gonna head over to Death Peak and end it there. So I have no idea how much time I have left. I think I'm like out of time, but I never know. Alright, so yeah, I'm gonna end it right here, and then next video I'll do Death Peak. Thanks for watching, hope you like the video, and I'll see you next time.